The price of freedom is death. We're coming to get our check. B1, brothers and sisters, welcome to the Afro Elite YouTube channel. If you're new to the channel, please make sure you guys leave a like. If you guys are returning to the channel, thank you for coming back. Make sure you leave a like as well and share this video on your various social media platforms. We're trying to get this channel to 4,000 subscribers by the end of 2022. We're on our way. Our supporters are helping. I'm trying to do my best. We're all working together as a team, and I greatly appreciate all of your support. So... In today's topic, we're going to be discussing a middle school teacher who confirmed to his school of mostly black children, his class of mostly black children, that he is a white supremacist and he believes in his race being the superior race. So without any further ado, I'm going to play the video uninterrupted and then we're going to circle back and then we're going to break it down. Ethnocentric, which means I think my race is the superior one. Oh! oh. Wait, no, let me hey, look. Let me so, white is better than all. No, let me finish. Let me finish. Go ahead. I think everybody thinks that. They're just not honest about it. Hey, I'm not racist, though. I like all types of kinds. Did I say I don't like people? People only you think that. Wait, so you said you are what? You are racist? You're saying you're like... You're I racist? think everybody's a racist at, at that level. No, you said you are racist. <laughs> I did. I did. Yeah, I'm trying to be honest. Yes, I'm no, I'm not saying it again. I've said it enough. So you're racist. I think I should like tell you something. Yes, you did. Put your phone up. I respected you. I actually respected you for a while, but like, I'm putting your phone up. I don't even got no more respect for you. Put it up. Yeah, for real. I don't think I got respect for him no more, bro. Mm -mm. You know, you should have more respect because I'm honest. You are a racist. Damn, how many times I gotta say it? <gasps> are you really? cussing at me? No, I'm not cussing at anybody. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm frustrated with this conversation. That's you started. You said you were a racist. You asked me. You were talking to him. Get him, my love. You said, yes, I'm a racist. Yes. Hey. Somebody asked a question, I I responded. Hey. I'll be sure to put this on the internet. Hey, I hope you know I'm famous, so I'm gonna play on the internet. I'll be sure to put this on the internet. Yeah, you guys, do what you need to do. I'm gonna call my father and tell him to pour this. Miss Hort is right over there. <laughs> and you know my and dad Ms. has Hort is black on Instagram, so I'm gonna tell him to post you, this. You you guys don't think that I've made peace with all this stuff? You think you mm. think I'm still walking around prejudice against people? Well, are you trying to say you used to think that? Yes, that's what I'm trying to say. Mm. No, Why'd you say I am? You said I, I am racist. No, no, you said I am racist. <laughs> <laughs> so you said I am racist. <laughs> That means you're with the hard S. That means right now. Like with the hard S. Can I finish? Just let me finish. Okay. Just tell me we're done. I think it's. um I think it's on. Okay. Un, uh, okay. He's trying to think up something to say. You don't know me at all. You can put words in my mouth. Just I'm let just me trying finish. I'm, what you I'm, trying to, I'm trying to explain to you something. That I've learned in my life. That's all I'm trying to say. I said a little bit. I have to go now. Go get up, mother. Alright, I'll let you know. If you weren't, you would have, you, if you weren't, you would not have just said. I, you, treat, you, I know, are, you guys, you guys. You treat me the wrongest out of everybody. Because every, every time, you would let these groups, you let them go to Miss Children's yeah. when they're passing. But when I need to go, no, you can't go. Like, bro. That's racist. And guess what? They're all not in my skin color. Even though that's color so racist. if I was racist, I wouldn't let you go to the restroom, would I? But you don't want him in your room. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you're wrong both ways. Now, I gotta go miss that. I'll see you later. But all I'll say Okay. So that's the uninterrupted clip. Now we're going to circle back and then I'm going to pause it where I need to and I'm going to break certain things down just in case you missed it. And I'm going to leave my commentary on it. Deep down in my heart, I'm ethnocentric, which means I think my race is the superior one. Oh, no, let me finish. Hey, look. Let me finish. Hey, look. So, white is better than all. No, let me finish. Let me finish. Go ahead. I think everybody thinks that. They're just not honest about it. Hey, I'm not racist, though. I like all types of kinds. Did I say I don't like people? People only you think that. Wait, so you said you are what? 
you are a racist. You're saying you're like. You're I racist? think everybody's a racist at, at that level. No, he said you are yeah, racist. You really I, I did. I did. Yeah, I'm trying to be honest. Yes, I'm no, I'm not saying it again. I've said it enough. So you're racist. I think I should like to tell you something. Yes, you Put your phone up. <laughs> I, 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 I'm, I'm I actually phone respected up. you for a while, but like, I'm now, your phone up. I don't even got no more respect for you. Put it up. Yeah, for real. I don't think I got respect for him no more, bro. Mm -mm. First off, shout out to those black children for not going along. He realizes he got messed up when he said it. And then that's when he was like, Oh, I feel like everybody is racist at that type of level. And the kids was all like, no, not really. I'm not racist. And they kept asking him, okay, so say what you said again, because they noticed like the whole ethnocentric, I think it's the superior race. And they was all like, oh, so that means you're racist. You don't want to say that, but that means you're racist. And he's like, well, everybody's kind of racist to a certain degree. And they were like, no, just say you're racist then. So, I like that the black kids are pushing him to give a more clear and direct answer. So he is not going to be able to try to spin it later, which he's already trying to backtrack and do it now. Well, you should have more respect because I'm honest. Yeah, yeah. So you are a racist? Damn, how many times I got to say it? <gasps> oh, really? Are you even cussing at me? No, I'm not cussing at anybody. Because <laughs> he's just, black. I'm frustrated he's with this conversation. Good. That you uh, started. You, said, like, uh, you asked the question. Uh, no, you were talking to him. Get it, my and love. He said, "Yes, I'm a racist." Yes. Hey. Somebody asked the question. I I responded. Hey. hey, I'll be sure to put this on the internet. Hey, I hope you know I'm famous, so I'm gonna play on the internet. I'll be sure to put this on the internet. Yeah, you guys do what you need to do. I'm gonna call my father and say I'm gonna post this. This horde is right over there. <laughs> and you know my and dad has over is black. on Instagram, so I'm gonna try to post you, this. You you guys don't think that I've made peace with all this stuff? You think you think I'm still walking around prejudice against people? Well, are you trying to say you used to think that? Yes, that's what I'm trying to say. Now, once again, shout out to those black kids because once they started saying that, okay, this is going to go on the internet, I'm going to tell my father, and he's going to post this on the internet, and we're kind of famous. We have a lot of, I guess, uh, internet interaction. We have a lot of people who follow us. Is really what he was trying to say. So this is really going to blow up in what you did. I like the fact that these black boys are connected enough with their father to immediately go tell him about this, which they did. That should be the connection between black children, especially young black children and their parents, especially their father. Anytime something comes up in school, their father should be the first person they go to to get the situation resolved. So I like to see that in this situation. Also, too, notice how the teacher is now trying to backpedal from saying I am racist, which he said I am what he quote unquote ethnocentric. I believe that my race is superior. Now he's trying to say, oh, I used to think that after the boys said, OK, well, we're going to put this on the Internet. You're going to be all over the Internet. Now he's trying to say, oh, you, you don't think I um, reconciled? You don't think I changed my mind? I mean, I'm talking about what I used to be. I'm not talking about what I said I was 10 seconds ago. I'm just talking about what I used to be. In the video, he didn't say he used to be racist. He said, this is what I believe, and I believe everybody is like that. That's how he tried to cover it. Now that they said, no, that's not acceptable, and we're putting you on the internet, then he's all like, well, I mean, I don't really think that anymore. I just uh, that's what it was like years ago. So let's continue. Mm. No, you Why'd you say I am? You said I, I am, am racist. You said I am racist. <laughs> <laughs> you said I am racist. <laughs> That means you're with the hard S. Right now, like with the hard S. Can I finish? Can I finish? Let me finish. Okay. Tell me we're done. I think it's. Um, I think it's un. Uh, He's trying to think up something to say. You don't know me at all. You can't put words in my mouth. Just let me finish. I'm trying, to, I'm, trying to, I'm trying to explain to you something. That I've learned in my life. What That's all I'm trying to say. I said a little bit. But I can't go now. We'll get up the first pass. 
Alright, You weren't, what are you? If you weren't, you would not have just said. I, you, 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 I know. Oh, you guys, you guys. You treat me the wrongest out of everybody. Because every, every time, you would let these groups, you let them go to Miss Children's yeah. when they're passing. But when I need to go, no, you can't go. Like, bro, that's racist. And guess what? They're all not in my skin color. So, my skin color so if I was racist, I wouldn't let you go to the restroom, would I? But you don't want him in your room. <laughs> I mean, you're wrong both ways. Now, I gotta go on the side. I'll see you later. But all I'll say is. So, ending that off, I like also, too, how you see the young black kid, and that was the young black kid with the, I guess, the famous dad. I guess his dad is a rapper or something. That was the kid, and he was all like, um, putting two and two together, like, okay, you just confirmed, he, and he literally did, in the video, confirm that he is a white supremacist who believes that his race is the superior race. And then the kid is starting to be all like, okay, well, that makes sense that you think that now because you treat me different than you treat all the other non-black kids. You let them go, uh, I guess, out or you give them passes or whatever. So all of this stuff is really clicking now. Why you treat me different because I'm black and they're not black. So all of this, um, all of this is clicking up. Shout out to those black kids. I'm like, I like the fact that they didn't back down. I like the fact that they um, weren't fooled when the teacher tried to backpedal or try to create some type of scapegoat for himself. He tried to save face by saying, oh, aren't we all kind of racist? Racist to an extent. There's no such thing as racist to an extent. You're racist or you're not racist. And the kids are all like, no, that's nobody's racist to an extent. You just said you were racist. And then he's like, oh, no, I, I, I mean, I was. Like, no, that's not what you just said. You just said that you firmly believe that your race is the superior race. So he got caught up. Now, there was an article after this was days after he was on suspended leave and then he got fired. So now we're going to read this article. A middle school teacher in Texas is no longer employed after a video posted on social media showed him telling students his race is superior. Quote, Deep down in my heart, I'm ethnocentric, which means I think my race is the superior one. The teacher was recorded telling students of various races last week inside a classroom at Balls Middle School, a 6th through 8th grade school in Filgerville, about 18 miles northeast of Austin. I think everyone thinks that, the teacher says. They're just not honest about it. The remark appeared to be directed at two black students. Some students challenged the teacher. One student says, quote, I'm not racist, though. I like all types of kinds. The teacher responds, did I say I didn't like people? Another black student asks the teacher, wait, so you said you were what? You are a racist? Quote, I think everyone is a racist at that level. The teacher responds, the same student tells him, no, but you said you are a racist. I did. I did. The teacher said a pair of black students then told the teacher that they no longer had respect for him. The school principal did not immediately return a request for comment. In a statement Monday, Douglas Killian, the superintendent of the Filgerville Independent School District, described the discussion as, quote, inappropriate inaccurate and unacceptable and said this type of interaction will not be tolerated in any of the district schools. As of Monday morning, November 14th, the teacher in question is no longer employed by the Filgerville ISD and we are actively looking for a replacement, he said. He did not identify the teacher who appears to be white. Tamara Spence, a spokesperson for the district said Monday she could not confirm the teacher's race. Killian said officials were made Friday, quote, of an inappropriate conversation a teacher at Bowles High School had with students during an activity class. Video of the conversation had been provided to administrators and posted on social media by some in the class, said Killian. 
who apologized in a statement to any parents whose children were shown in the video without their knowledge. He also apologized to the students and families at the middle school, quote, for the undue stress and concern this has caused and said counselors and administrators are on hand for any of them who want to discuss the situation further. Quote, we want to reiterate that this conversation does not align with our core beliefs and is not a reflection of our district or our culture at Bowles Middle School, end quote. He said, adding that the school's district and the middle school staff, quote, work together to create an inclusive and welcoming environment for all of the students. We always do our best to ensure the safety of all students. We encourage them to be self-advocates and let an adult know when something is wrong, as they did in this situation. He continued, if you see something, say something. Quote, the reason why we were appalled is because it was offensive, and we definitely wanted to make sure our voice was heard, he said in an interview Monday. I think more parents need to stand up, especially the parents who had kids in the classroom. Huntington said his son was offended and saddened by the video and that some of his friends were in the class where the discussion took place. He said the only suitable outcome would be for the teacher to be fired. You are not hired to bring your opinions into the classroom, especially when you have impressionable minds, Huntington added. Those kinds of exploratory conversations, that's for the parents to expose their kids to. So that was an article. So apparently he's been fired. They're all getting on cold. They don't want to release the, the teacher's name. They don't, they're saying that they don't even know his race. I don't know why they're making that excuse as if the video has not already gone viral and everybody can't tell that this person is um, white. Like I don't know what they're doing. He said he believes in Eurocentrism. I mean, he's not like, I don't know what they're doing. So he's been fired. Shout out to those kids for not only recording, but standing up to him during the conversation and then posting it later. Uh, I think his teaching license should be removed. He should never be able to teach at all, period. This is ridiculous in the fact that these kids had to face this teacher's racism all the way up until this teacher just comfortably opened up with the fact that he is racist and he believes in white supremacy, which is what he said. Um, I feel for those children. And I believe that that school needs to be sued, especially by those children who are in those classes and who have faced racism by his hands. I would like to bring up another incident of a racist teacher, this time in Kankakee, who threw a book at his black student. And then when the black student got into a verbal altercation and walked off, he called his black student a racial slur. This time, though, we do know the teacher's name. The teacher's name is John Donovan. But without any further ado, let's play the clip. <laughs> oh, oh. Yep, you heard it. He tried to assault the student with a book. The student got up and he confronted the teacher about throwing a book at him. The student walks off and he calls him a effing N-word. And then he says casually, I'm going to lose my job anyway. So who, I guess, who cares if they find out that I am racist, an anti-black racist? This teacher was put on paid leave originally, but then the school eventually had to terminate the teacher. So now he is unemployed by that school. Luckily, or hopefully, he will lose his license sometime in the near future and he will never teach, especially any other black students ever again. But this is why I say we need to do for our own. We need to teach our own. So I am a very big advocate of either homeschooling or privately black owned schools. Because 
from middle school to high school, you can see that our black students are susceptible to the racism of their teachers. These are just two small clips, but we have clips that go viral every week almost. We need to do for ourselves. We cannot allow these white supremacist teachers, which is what they confirmed to them, their school, their class that they were, we cannot allow them to teach our students. And we wonder, or not really, but people question why there's a school to prison pipeline, especially for the young black boys out there. That's because these are the people who are supposed to be teaching the class. You wonder why when a student is failing, and they say, oh, well, your kid can't pay attention in class. We need to put him on medication. We need to put him on special needs. And you wonder why that is, is because the teacher is racist. The teacher believes in white superiority. And this happens all the time. These two teachers really just didn't care about being recorded. But you have a lot of teachers who move a little bit more covert, a little bit more low key about it. And they don't get caught on camera, but they do the same things all the time. But let me know what you think about this in the comments below. Thank you very much for watching. Follow me on my social media. The link is in the description below. And subscribe and post, hit that post notification bell if you have not done so. Once again, be one salute to all the brothers and sisters out there. Thank you very much for watching.